Hello again and welcome. Recently YouTube had recommended a video. It was from Mr. Carlson's lab. He showed a video where he had an antique flashlight from World War II and it didn't require a battery. It had a little generator built in this flashlight and you would squeeze the handle and that would power the light bulb. At the end of the video he had said that it would be possible maybe to modify that using modern electronics and potentially improve the performance where you didn't have to pump it continuously. I thought I'd do a little video demonstration of something like that. So this is a homemade flashlight right here. This is actually really bright. <laughs> you can see this is all made out of scrap. Even the batteries came from the scrap bin. So this flashlight doesn't require a battery at all. The generator works a little bit differently. It's essentially a motor. We're just going to twist this knob to charge up a super cap. You can see this is a 10 volt 0.22 farad capacitor made by NEC. I acquired this capacitor back in the 1980s. This is the LED in the lens out of this Astro AI M6KOR. So I'll give you a little demonstration. You don't have to turn this a whole lot. As a matter of fact, it's probably active right now. Maybe you can see that. See, it's quite a bit brighter. All I have here is four 4002 diodes set up as a bridge rectifier. And then I have a resistor in series to limit the current going through our LED. And that's it. So what I'm going to do is give this a few turns. And then I'm going to point this at our clock here. And I'm going to turn off all the lights in the room. And let's just see how long this operates for. Okay, so lights are off in the room here. So what I'm going to do is just charge this up real quick. And then I'm going to point it at the clock. And then we'll see how long this runs for. I'll just stop winding right at the top of the hour. There you go. Try not to wash out the clock. It's getting pretty dim there, so that's been four or five minutes. I'll have to go back and watch the video. All I'm going to do now is try to just give this thing one rotation. Let's try two rotations. We'll see if it gets any brighter. Not much. So it doesn't take a lot of effort to recharge it. and It certainly runs for at least a minute. Now again, there's no regulator or anything in this. Of course, you could get a smaller package supercapacitor than this that would probably fit into that flashlight that he's got. Certainly the LED and the bridge rectifier and the resistor would all fit. So yeah, that probably would improve the performance of that flashlight. 
of course like he said that thing is a piece of history and if he's anything like me you're not gonna try to modernize something like that well that's gonna be it for this video hopefully you enjoyed it and we'll see you in the next video later